Alright, hey, Shalom, my camp. First and foremost, I to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Raka, Kodash, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. And we are the Hebrew Israelites, which consists of the Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, Simul Indians, West Indians, and Haitians. And according to the Holy Scriptures, we're God chosen people. Shalom to all the brothers out there, pushes knowledge and sincerity and truth. Shalom to the few sisters and shalom to Israelite foreigners who are scattered abroad. And what you're looking at is a true depiction of one day when he called Jesus Christ, whose real name in the Hebrew is Yahweh Shai. And what you're looking at is a true depiction of the one day when he called God, the one that you ignorantly, ignorantly call um, Jehovah, whose real name in the Hebrew is Yahweh. When you call upon the Most High and the Son, you must say Yahweh, Bahashim. Yahweh Shai. Yahweh means He exists, the existing one, or He is. Bahashem means in the name and Yahweh Shai means he delivers. Our Lord and Savior has come back to deliver the elect out of the nation of Israel upon the destruction of the modern day Babylon, aka America. All right, coming back, catch you another lesson through the Holy Spirit. This is a dope ass pick right here. Giving all praise to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, man. Because Yahweh Shai is on his way. Yahweh Shai is on his way with everything that's transpiring right now. And it's ain't time to be weak. Got your head down and you know what I'm saying speaking for myself as well Hey man, hey man, the, the whole thing that happened in Brooklyn, New York Which we, we already know what it is, but you know People you know, people actually got shot from, from what I'm hearing, you know that, the, the scene was real So now they, you know, they they painting this, this narrative They put in Jake as a new face of terrorism but, but guess what, we got the insight Beloved brothers been doing shows, we be communicate. Hey, giving all praise to Yahweh by Shimei Yahweh Shai because nothing's going to go down unless Yahweh Yahweh Shai allows it to happen. Pretty much, this, this devil is on his way out, man. Esau, the Edomites, the whole uh, you know, power structure they have over the earth. Job 9 and 24, the earth has been given to the hands of the wicked, is on his way out. The Most High set a bound that he cannot pass. So everybody else, you know, they don't know what, you know, majority of our people don't know what's going on. So the elect, that small remnant, that, that little flock, we, we're the threat. Because we, we, our spirits is not geared to, to be given over to his, um, his new world order. Our spirits has been geared to be the mouthpiece of the Heavenly Father, the mouthpiece of our people. Starting off with the elect. He's giving all praise to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai for another day, another opportunity to fight this good fight of faith. And Lord willing to the end, man. I want to listen to this Jordan Maxwell skit real quick. I would say that nothing in this world works the way you think it does. Nothing. Governments do not operate the way you think they do. Banks do not do what you think they do. <clears throat> the police department is not here for what you think it is. Nothing in your world works the way you think it does. There's a far higher bigger picture going on on the earth for at least 7,000 years of human history that we modern day people really just don't relate to. All we know is what we live with today. But never suspecting that the institutions of power, banking, <clears throat> education, the military industrial complex of the world, has taken hundreds of years to develop. I would say that nothing in this world works the way you think it does. And that's the point. Nothing in this world works the way you think it does, man. Because everything is set up through the Holy Spirit and everything takes place on this planet, on planet Earth. Heaven is my throne and the Earth is the most size footstool, man. So we got the drop on this devil on this new world order through the spirit of prophecy. That's the Holy Spirit that the Heavenly Father has given his men out here, his uh, few men and, and a few sisters out there in, in man. You know, I was looking at the beloved Apostle Tahar video, and uh, he went into that part trying to look for the uh, information on GMS and the RFID chip. And it was hard to find, man. I wonder, yo, that's crazy. Over the years, Brothers did all kinds of videos on the Mark of the Beast, the correct breakdown. But now, we're pretty much shadow man. You got to be inside the circle to get 
the true information, the true breakdown of the scriptures. You understand what I'm saying? So, hey, hey, we, hey, Yahweh shot. We about to get out of here real soon, you know, and, and everything is going to transpire. Don't need to panic. Don't need to, you know what I'm saying? We, we got we got the blueprint, brothers and sisters. Yeah, it's going to be crazy. Yeah, there's no mobile force flags and all that, but the events that's going to be taking place is real. Motherfuckers, people are going to get killed. However, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh allowed this devil to let things happen. So we definitely been doing the right thing, man. You know what I'm saying? We it, it, we storing up our, our, our treasures in heaven, man. Okay? This is uh, Matthew 6 and 19. It says, lay not up for yourselves treasures upon earth. Because nothing... This is, the, this is the devil's kingdom, man. We, we looking forward... Looking forward to a new heaven, a new earth under Yahweh Shai, which dwell in righteousness. The next rulership is going to be pure righteousness. This is a great education, the effects of wickedness, what it does to our planet. Where moth and rust do it corrupt, and where thieves break through and steal, that, that, and, and break-ins and, and, and thievery and murdering, and that's going to, it's going to continue to escalate in these trying times to come. So for us that's been doing the right thing, man, we're going to be, you know, we're going to be all right. I thoroughly believe that because we've been doing the right thing. Because I'm telling you, if you go watch that video Pastor Hard did, IUIC videos came up, all, all, you know, all the camps. And the one with the true doctrine is being shadow banned. And that's, a, man, I was like, whoa. So what the hell we, yo, Lord willing to the end. We, we got a spiritual bank account, Lord willing, on a Scrooge McDuck level. For, for, the, for the prophets, man, the true men of the Lord. But lay up for yourselves treasures in heaven, meaning the next rulership to come, because the kingdom of heaven is going to be on this planet, where neither moth nor rust do it corrupt, and where thieves do not break through or steal. We got this knowledge, man. This knowledge, brothers out there putting in that work, brothers plowing, trimming their ways, examining themselves, being a the brother, following these commandments to the best of our ability. Teaching the right doctrine. Esau can't fuck with this, man. So that's why this whole Karagma thing is you're going to try to get inside you to, to control your conscience. But he has a great opposition. We might be few on the, on the, you know, on the outward appearance, but it's as many of us. You got to remember that, 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 that breakdown with Alicia. There's more of us than them, man. The angels are out here. You understand what I'm saying? Okay, it says, for where your treasure is, there will your heart be also. Where your, Where is your mind at, Jake? Our mind is on this kingdom, the, these prophecies, teaching this word. Enduring all hardness is a good soldier, low one to death. And this this, this, this information is leading us to, to, to a, a, a greater and brighter future for the whole creation's sake. Start with the Israelites, man. Even the heathens outside of Esau, they're going to be taken care of in the kingdom. You know, nowhere on that level. But you understand what I'm saying? These, these heathens, they have their purpose on this planet. You see, Esau has his purpose and his purpose to show forth wickedness and the effects of it, man. And guess what? He's at his last stand. He's going to pull like blood brother be saying, pull some tacky shit to make us look crazy. All of a sudden now, Jake got smoke bombs. Get the fuck. Average, what a average Negro in Brooklyn. Come on, man. But it is what it is. This is all part of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai's program, man. So nothing is what really, nothing is what you, what it really seems, man. You see, gross darkness is, is, is covered the people, but Yahweh, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai is about to reveal everything real soon, man. As you can t see, time is speeding up. Time is sped up. And that's biblical, man. For for what? For the elect's sake. All right, Matthew 24. It says, uh, Matthew 24 and verse 20 says, But pray he that your flight be not in winter, neither on the Sabbath day, then with 70 AD, for then shall be great tribulation, such as was such as was not since the beginning of the world. To this time, no, nor ever shall be. 
And except those days should be shortened, there shall no flesh be saved, man. But for the elect's sake, those days shall be shortened. Okay, so you know you're dealing with 70 AD and, and you're dealing with what's got about to transpire in the modern day Roman Empire, man. The days are being shortened as you as you come on, they 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 um they passed the bill to keep the daylight same as time to where it is today. Cause why? Because Yahweh Shai pull up this picture, the one you're going to call Jesus Christ, is on his way to get his people, man. And the water Yahweh by Shimi Yahweh Shai. They're giving us all the brothers, all the brethren out there this shot, man. Because many are called and few are chosen. Shalom.